Well, the tension and the buzz is palpable as this fight gets started. Interesting stylistic matchup. Your thoughts on what you This is a big time matchup between a fantastic striker and a great all shots nicely here tonight, DC. She's doing a great job, but not only being active, she is so accurate. She's on point tonight. Nice. Well, Nunez's head coach, Conan Silvera, felt like her boxing would pay dividends here tonight, and a beautiful one-two by the champion there. And you watch it. You know, you watch when she lands, the reaction she gets from her opponent. She is hitting them with damaging strikes, and they are not able to take them. Oh, she didn't telegraph that one at all. Spinning back fish. All right, so she lands yet another leg kick there. She's landed several in the round, and now you see the damage is obvious. I mean, look at the redness in the leg, the bruising, the welt on the leg Nasty. from those leg kicks. Unbelievable to watch someone land that kick over and over again. But if it's working, why would you change it? Keep going to the world. Man, her striking looks clean tonight, timing on point. Her timing's on point, her accuracy's on point. She's very busy, she's in a good flow. So as we pull up some numbers here, 29 total strikes have landed for the Lioness Amanda Nunes. Oh, look at that combination, I got two! Can't take pictures now, she has to react. She has to go chase the finish. that when she's chasing the finish, she doesn't get excited and lose the position. Maybe seeing stars at this point. Her opponent's seeing stars. Her opponent's hurt. She has to really get after her now and try to find that kill shot that's gonna finish tonight. And they both stand up. Good series of strikes by her there. She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed and it looks like she's gonna finish this fight. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, nice combination. Oh! Oh, big nice knee. Hand. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish this fight? Oh! Gets up again here, but Hurton. So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Good punch, Lance. Some huge connection by her there. Lower the curtain. Bring the cast out. Bring the cast out. You take the foul. The night's over. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that previous round. And she got knocked down. Didn't see that strike coming. No, she didn't see it. Round two underway. Big kick land. Oh, massive knee to the body back here. Can't oh, hold this. Oh, this big line shot is still suspicious to close the show here. Landed that strike perfect. She was looking for it, and she followed the moment. We're in there. I'm not sure her striking has ever looked better, DC. Finding the range with relative ease here, too. She's doing a great job of timing everything. She is seeing everything out there. Clinch battle continues. Now she's got over on it. And they separate. That's a big strike right there. All right, so another swing and a miss. And I'd imagine if you're gas tank. But she can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. All right, so she's able to work her way back to her feet now. No! She can't take pictures now. No! Big knee to the body! Knees here to the body. What a fight. Oh, straight right. DC, for my money, she's really timing her shots pretty well here tonight. Her timing, accuracy, and also the activity level is great tonight.
option, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. Get up, get up, get up. Two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, and with conviction, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. Well, she did not miss a single grappling practice during this training camp, and here's your evidence. Outstanding movement, Oscar. She looks like a master of grappling with the great movement that she's showing on the ground. Oh, nice job by her there. You see how strong she is. Her opponent's trying to control posture, unable to do so. Now she can get to work and put the money in the bank with that grounding bomb. Money in the bank. Solid strike on the ground. She postures up here, DC, and see if she can get those ground strikes. Going. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Oh, nice job by her to posture up there. Now we'll see if she can maintain that separation. She has to recognize that her opponent will start trying to squirrel away now, but look for her big round of bomb. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. Talk to you. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, here we go, third and final round. Well, back to her feet here, but man, is she hurt. Just the way she drew it up, she had her focus on the knockout, and that's exactly the way this fight ends. I'm not even sure the opponent saw the shot coming. They oftentimes say it's the shot you don't see coming that spells your fate, and that certainly spelled her fate here tonight. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at 21 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Amanda the Lioness Well, there she is, and you can be sure there's going to be a long line at the after.